looking at this. It is an indoor spice rack. They're $2. This is what they look like. And you just lay them flat in your drawers. So, I think I might get me two of these. This is at Walmart, by the way, you guys. Yes, I'm in the stores again this morning. But, it's Enter Design in Drawer Spice Rack. So, I'm going to try it out for two bucks. Can't go wrong with that. This is in their clearance aisle. They have these salt and pepper shakers. Um, do I have my light on? Let me see. Okay, there we go. They're two bucks. I think they're kind of cute. I'm not going to get them. But they're pretty cute. They have this really nice lace. It's by Wire Burlap Ribbon. It's three dollars. How many feet on here? Uh, it looks like it's two and an inch by ten inch. Uh, looks like it's quite a bit. Three dollars. Pretty. Don't know if I'm gonna get that. I love these. They're five dollars. And then these. I'll try these. Those are three fifty. Three fifty. Okay. These are really pretty guys. How much is that? These are four dollars and fifty cents. Well this one is. It's by itself. It's the only one I see. Well, there's another one back there. Yeah, they got some stuff up here today. It's not too bad. I think they had these at the dollar store, but they just had the base. And with the glass and the tin, it's five dollars. Okay. I'm trying to see what else they got. Okay. Oh shoot. I found this. And I don't know if this is nine dollars or something else, but you can't uh my thing is not coming in real good for whatever reason. Okay. It looks like nine. Probably not. But it's a dash cam. And it's by this Jinny. I'm going to take it up there and see what they say. What mode, camera mount, all this stuff. If it's nine bucks, I'll get it. But if it's more than that, no. So, we shall see. We shall see. Juliana probably will like this. She knows who this girl is. And they're adhesive stickers. So, for $1.97, I can get that. Okay, I found this. It is a magnet storage pocket. It has two. It's by Mead. And it is $2.50. So it's kind of nice, guys. I can use that for my mail. Not a bad buy. Again, this is Walmart. Found another one of those stickies, a dollar ninety-seven. She was going to use these on her pillows for her friends that she might be making pillows for. So another one of those. These are really nice, but not for $6.87. A little bit too much. Wish they were lower. I remember this game as a kid. Simon Says. <laughs> they had it in a bigger version, though. I don't see a price on it. Probably more than what I want to spend. Okay, I found these. I think you can make them into picture frames. So, we're going to try that and see how our DIY turns out on that one. Okay, and by the way, they're only $3. I'm trying to think maybe I should get two of those. It is by Burlap. 
Is that the name of it? Um, not for sure, but I think that's what's on there. So, give it a try. Okay, I'm not going to turn this around. I'm just going to have you look at this right there. Um, I went in Walmart's and shopped in there, found some items, and it's just like, I tell you guys all the time, I just believe that God sets me up for things. He just sets me up. So I'm walking through the aisles, and this lady comes up to me, and she's like, do you have money to spare for bus fare? And I'm like, well, I really don't carry change on me, honey. And she says, you have no change on you at all? And then I thought about it, I said, oh, I think I got a dollar in my, um, in my wallet. I said... So tell me, well, how did you get locked out? And she goes through this long story, which didn't make a bit of sense. But you know what? I'm not looking down on her. <laughs> I am not. I refuse to do that. I mean, I spoke with her just as sweet as she wanted to be. I know the story wasn't all what she was putting it to be. I gave her that dollar, but I did tell her this. I told her, I said, you know that if they catch you in this store doing this, you're going to be in trouble. She kind of looked at me and laughed. And then this lady, who had to be the manager of the store... She comes by. Now, this is all in Walmarts up here on 50th and Ames. And she asked me, she said, was she, was she trying to take something? I said, no, no, just getting some bus fare <laughs> for something. So, you know, I gave her the dollar. No big deal. It was a dollar, you know. Then I get in line and this lady says to me, she says, what you doing, making pillows? And I said, yeah. I said, my grandbaby, you know, she's been doing a couple of days now she's doing pretty good making pretty good and we just begin to talk and lo and behold guess what she's on youtube she's doing but this lady is off the chain i'm gonna put her um website out there she and her daughter they do a lot of craft shows and stuff you know i'm just so grateful that god is opening doors and one thing this lady said to me she said you know if you don't talk to people you you don't learn and I have never been a person that's afraid to speak to people. People may not speak to me, but sometimes I can be overly friendly. But you know what? I thank God for that trait. I got that trait from my mother. People would meet my mother and just, I don't know, they would just get so attached to her. You know, just from conversation. So I'm so grateful that that's in all of us kids. We're very approachable. You know, and some I'm a hugger. I have to stop that sometimes because some people don't want to be touched. But that's how I am. I think I'm the most approachable person. And so she gave me her card. I'm going to check her out. And I'm just grateful. I'm grateful for this day. I'm grateful that I was able to bless somebody even though I only had a dollar because I don't carry change on me. I gave it to her. I mean, I gave it to her. Okay, what can she do with a dollar? Um, and then the, the lady, the other crafter. So this is a good day. Got grandparent... Uh, 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 not a program, but it's where I go to uh, Olivia's school. She goes to Montessori, and they have Grandparent Day every year. So she looks so forward to me coming to do that. So I'm going to go do that. Then Juliana has swim classes tonight, and um, today is their last day of school. So <laughs> this is Good Money Stewart. You like my channel, two thumbs up. You don't, thumbs down. If you really like it, Hit that subscription button, and every time I do a new upload, you'll get it. Hey, peace out, blessings. God loves you. Bye-bye.